Marcus pulled that guy right out of there. Yeah, baby. Thanks for joining us here on Three Pound Fishing. Putting the hammer down again. I'm, I'm up here watching live scope, and I watched Mark just pick that one. Marcus picked that one right out of this little bitty school. It's awesome. We're here doing the same thing that we've been doing, which is just chasing these schools. And right now they're not as big as we'd like them to be, but it's just really cool to see little bitty schools and then Marcus picks one right out of there. So it's awesome. Get ready for a fantastic episode from Three Pound Fishing. Thanks to these great sponsors. This guy go back, but that's probably a 10 and a half, 11 inch fish right there. Let's see how your screen looks. Pink head, yellow and white, which is called the whatchamacallit color from Jinko Fishing. Curly fry, check it out. One eighth ounce head, six pound line, high viz all day long using the brush buster from Ozark Rods. Check them out. Three pound code for 10% off. Check them out. That's freaking money right there, boys and girls. You see that line jump, boy? Right in the heart of it. <laughs> That's a pig. Nice. That's a pig. <laughs> How you doing, big guy? <laughs> All day long. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> Putting on a clinic today. That's a good one. That's a hog. Man. <laughs> Throw that off. Ah. Woo! Thick sucker there. So new location. We're fishing with my buddy Reno. He is right next to us. Let me show you. I'm sure he'll wave to you. There he is. Back at it. Oh, that's a good kick. That's a good fish. He came hard off. Right off that line of oh yeah. Woo -hoo -hoo. Nice fish. <laughs> Ooh, that's a that's that's a friggin' magnolia. No kidding. That is a huge magnolia. That could tie my best. Nice shot. Magnolia, black nose. You can see that black nose. That is a huge fish. Let's check it out. My biggest is 14 inches. Oh, 13 and a half. Hey, Reno. 13 and a half black nose. That is awesome. Bam! You gotta love it. It doesn't get much better than this. Marcus is, Marcus is hooked up. Good fish. Every time I sit down at this live scope, I catch a fish. <laughs> Beauty. They're 
missing out. I need to let this sink or wait. No, they're four to eight feet. Stole that one from me, Reno. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a little guy. We'll let him go. How long you been out? Oh. Marcus is hooked up again. I don't know if I like this bluegrass more. Good fish. Man. Oh, that's fun. Beautiful. That's funny, man. That bluegrass ain't getting nothing. I've been crushing it with yellow and white and monkey milk. The third double up today. <laughs> Good fish right there, folks. So we've got a calm day, no wind. Blue bird day for the most part of it. And, ooh, and I'll tell you. So you just gotta stay away from these fish. Stay at least 30 feet. This is a good fish. If you get any closer than that, look at this guy's a good fish. I wanna remind everybody, guide trips this winter, it'll be like this all winter long. So whether we're fishing coves or we're chasing schools, we're gonna be putting big fish in the boat. That's a solid 12 and a half inch fish right there. Catch them on the on the flip side. Drop it right there. We'll be in the heart of it. Can you get a yep, we're right there in the heart of it. Bam! Look at that. That's <laughs> 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 yeah, so funny.
folks. Anybody can do it. <laughs> Bam! Yes, sir. Happy holidays. <laughs> And then Marcus gets hicked up. Feel like small. Just a little guy. All I did was watch my high vis line jump. We got a small school. A small school, folks. It's a big school. Big school of small fish. Small fish. But a lot of fun. That's what that's forecast in a row bite. Man, folks, we're having a ball. We're putting some fish in the boat, no doubt about it, and having a lot of fun too. So, you know, that's what's most important to us in terms of crappie fishing. And I'll tell you what, this live scope has definitely changed the game. All we're doing is chasing these small schools around the lake, mainly the main part of the lake. And I'll tell you, the key was today was never to get any closer than 30 foot, because as soon as they got within that 20 foot range, you'd spook them and they'd get out of the way. So always stay out casting towards them curly tail that type of thing and boy we were putting a lot of slabs in the boat got a few more catches for you thanks for joining don't forget to subscribe this is three pound fishing Beauty. What a beaut. Good fish. This is a good fish. That's a, nice. that's a 13, 14. That's got to be about 14 right there. Hey, thanks for joining us today. We appreciate it. Chasing schools, winter fishing, three pound fishing guide service. Take all the guesswork out of it. Book. Mark does it. Marcus does it all the time. He's, a, he's, he's one of my best clients. <laughs> <laughs> Big fish. Well, there you have it, folks. We got a five-gallon bucket full. Let me tell you, we had a ball doing it. Man, it was a beautiful day, and uh, nothing better than putting slabs in the boat. Please subscribe. Thanks for watching.